There are stars which are billions of years older than our sun. Some of them very likely have planets, and therefore I can imagine civilizations immensely beyond the capabilities of our own. What capabilities those are, no one can tell. In the same sense that even the most fantastic prognostications from the middle of the 19th century about uh, the technology of the 20th century all fell short. People like Jules Verne asked to imagine what transportation devices people would have in 1950, imagined a kind of Victorian living room yes. with plush velvet furniture in a gondola at the bottom of an enormous balloon which went from New York to San Francisco in only a few weeks. And he was, of course, the most imaginative speculative thinker of the 19th century. Others would have been more cautious. So it's very difficult to predict far into the future, even 100 years, when uh, not only new technology, but new scientific principles may be discovered. So I would say that um, there, there are several lines of approach, all of which uh, look promising and should be pursued further. One is laboratory work on the uh, question of the origin of life, making the molecules which uh, here were able to reproduce themselves and led eventually to us. Secondly, a study of the organic chemistry in places like Jupiter, comets, and the interstellar medium. It's remarkable that the molecules of life are littering the cosmos. Thirdly, the space vehicle exploration of the neighboring planets, in particular for life or life-related compounds. If it turns out, for example, that Mars is lifeless, that is not a major disappointment, because then we have two planets near each other in space and time, life developed on one and not on the other, you have the classic case of an experiment and a control. And uh, it'd be very important to investigate why life on the Earth and not on Mars. But even more exciting would be if uh, Mars turns out to have life, for us to investigate what kind of life it is, how similar, how different from life on Earth, that will immensely broaden the science of biology. And then uh, there is certainly the serious work, long-term, patient, cautious, investigation of uh, other stars for possible signals being sent our way.